There's good news and bad news about the coconut rhino beetle. The good news, UOG entomologist Dr. Aubrey Moore has successfully used tiny radio tracking devices to track beetles back to their nests. The bad news is he found they can nest in some very unexpected places and now he's expecting a population boom in the next few months. What I'm really worried about is uh, if this positive feedback cycle is real, uh, it's not going to end until all the food's gone, which means we're going to lose a lot of trees. University of Guam entomologist Dr. Aubrey Moore says they found new breeding sites for the coconut rhino beetle after strapping radio transmitters to their backs. They followed one beetle in particular that led them to a very unexpected site. It wasn't on the ground, it was up in a tree, not a coconut tree, it was in a breadfruit tree. The good news is the radio transmitters worked well and allowed them to find new types of breeding sites. They now know the beetles can breed inside of rotting tree branches that are high up on the trees. The bad news is... I got thinking, well, you know, there's got to be thousands of sites like this throughout the, the jungles on Guam. Uh, most of them are inaccessible. You know, they're little tiny sites. Uh, we can't get in there. It's, a lot of them are on military bases. Right now we're seeing massive amounts of... Uh, Beetles flying around, um, and the worst thing is they're, they're starting to kill more trees, making more food, so we're into a really nasty positive feedback cycle. This is just the first part of the cycle, which Dr. Moore believes began after a lot of trees were downed and damaged during Typhoon Dolphin last summer, creating new breeding sites. If this breeding cycle rings true, Guam could see a boom in the rhino beetle population in the next few months or so. Although Guam has a type of beetle that was resistant to a previous virus, Dr. Moore is still confident that they can find a strain of virus that will work on the type of coconut rhinoceros beetle found here on Guam.